the 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 palette of words that a Christian MC has is it's not just shorter. It's like if if a regular hip hop artist has let's just keep it in some terms we could talk about. If a regular hip hop artist has a thousand words to choose from, sure. a Christian hip hop artist has probably like less than a hundred words to choose from. You think so? Let's get the people what they want. The Wado Radio Show. DJ Wado here with my brother Saint Chuck. What up, what up, what up, man? Live at Ja Rockin'. What's Finally. up, my brother? Hey man, we doing God is good. You know what I'm saying? Hey. That's what that's what time it is. Hey man. man. Yeah. All the time. So you, so you taking us to church in here, man. I'm, I'm trying to wait to go to church, bro. You trying to take yeah, us to church bro. In here, yeah, man. bro. That's the only thing I can think of, man. That's oh what's man, up, bro. So listen, we uh, we got to get down to business, man, because uh, we got this mixtape dropping. Yeah, yesterday, yeah. yesterday. Yeah, yeah oh. man. So, uh, yeah. what can the people expect? From people that haven't downloaded this tape. I'm a student of hip hop, so. You got a lot of stuff going from the the golden era up to up classic. To, you got a lot of classic joints. Classic, and then so what? 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 My endeavor is as far as musically, because I, I, you know, I'm very critical musically though, and uh, so my endeavor is to, um, to to homogenize all these expressions like i don't got to tell you there's so many expressions and people are just reaching they're exploring they bring in together different musical styles and then they're trying to mix rock and pop and and and, and, and hip hop hip rock soul and all that you know what i mean so just 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 bringing it up to the present and i like to think that i'm taking the best of and just bringing it to the mc mic not necessarily like you're hearing a new beat but as far as how I'm trying to uh, bring, come to the mic, just kind of attack it differently. Yeah, I'm trying to. I'm trying to, or at least I'm trying to take it as a tool palette and and just and and just from an MC perspective, I think an MC can appreciate what I'm doing. You know what I mean? Where and just trying to and just trying to work with that uh, with that palette. You know, from back way back to now, taking the best of because you know some of the some of the old heads like if we just talking hip hop, not necessarily Christian hip hop. Some of the old heads, the reason why they couldn't stay relevant is because they couldn't yeah, they couldn't, couldn't transition. You know, they kind of got caught in they, or they tried, and and everyone was like, "No, you're whack." You yeah, know what I mean? And, and so they fell off. You know, yeah. different ones. Even like I hate to say it, but even like El Cool J, he just couldn't. He wanted, but he just he, couldn't. But he had a long run, though. He bro. did have a long run, he but long but run. if it was up to him, he would still be like on billboards. Okay. You know okay. what I mean? So it's like only certain ones can really. You know the one the one that hurt me, too, Rakim and KRS. Right, right, right. You know what I mean? Because when I started getting into hip hop, those dudes had already cemented their place. Right. On at that time, what was the Mount Rushmore? Right. And then it was like when things transitioned into the big, the Jay Z, the Tupac era. Then, you know what I'm saying, like, the Eminem, the 50 Cent, the Kanye, by then, them dudes was, like, old school at that point, you know what yeah, I mean? They, just so, didn't, they, didn't, they didn't even keep up technically, right? and that was the problem. It's almost like, we got this, and they only could think of themselves where they were, so they didn't they didn't make the necessary changes to stay perfectly relevant. Somebody like Eminem, though, he, he, keeps, he keeps studying, you know, you can tell every so time. So let me ask you this, then. How are you able to keep up? Because uh, you, you've been... You've been you've time. been you've been rapping for a little. It's you been know a, what I mean? it's been a run, and um, how if, if I'm keeping up? Because I don't like to you know to talk of myself. So up, everybody you know? had to decide if you keep it up. Or not. Somebody <laughs> had to, they had they had to decide that for themselves. I, I think we keeping up, but um, if if I'm keeping up, it's because I keep listening. I keep sure. I keep listening. I keep I stay at it. I keep my ear on. If I hear something you know that 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 moves me, I eat it up. You know what I mean? And then and then and then it just automatically comes out. When when I when I express myself, so you know, but I but the thing is too is I love hip hop. Sure, like you, you hear some cats say, oh, you know, uh, you know, hip hop artists say, oh, I don't listen to rap all the time. I'm like, I ain't that guy. I like listen to rap all the time. Like yeah. seriously, like every chance I get, it's coming in my ears. What and, moves you now then? Oh God, I mean, I'm listening to. Um, uh, I like I like a lot of what I like a lot of what Gom is doing, man. Mm. Just being honest about it, I like. Oh, in a Christian rap space. Yeah, in a yeah, Christian, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, I mean, that's all really I really eat, you know, because I, because, you know, where where is the point at which content is really like I was in online and and and, and we was getting into it. I was getting into it with a with a well known MC, just kind of exchanging and, and talking. It was a Christian MC, and 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 I explained to him. I was like, look, um, the 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 palette of words that a Christian MC has is it's not just shorter 
it's like if if a regular hip hop artist has let's just keep it in some terms we could talk about if a regular hip hop artist has a thousand words to choose from sure a christian hip hop artist has probably like less than a hundred words to choose from you think so well just because you think it's that big a difference though i mean i'm, I'm not saying the actual a thousand versus a hundred but I'm saying you think it's that big a difference because I'm thinking I'm thinking swear words. Yes, yeah, swear but, words. But, but then, how many of them are there though? But it's not just swear words; it's the content that you talk about. Uh, okay, uh, like That's Eminem, fair. he could just talk about anything. That's fair. You know what I'm saying? That's just fair. it could just be it could make sense. It could not make sense. One minute he could be making sense, the next minute he not making sense. He could just you know, and then he could just go ballistic on some old pornographic craziness, and then he could just come back next thing you know he's talking about God. A, a Christian MC really don't uh, not that's trying to stay real. He don't really go there. He he's trying to stay. If you're trying to really, are you trying to say something? Or are you just trying to? But uh, I feel like you can though, man. You you can you can. And now think, just think about it, right? Think about it. You just brought up Bizzle. Think about this, right? Bizzle has a song where he's talking about struggling with pornography. Right now he's not graphic. But the thing is, like though, he's not saying, "Yo, I'm going." You know what I mean? Like he's but, not. But he's he's got a message, and the thing is, is the secular artist does not have to have a message. They just can rhyme and they can string words together because it's like already just being an MC, you already limited because you're trying to rhyme and you got certain word cadence, and now you're multisyllabic, so that that condenses down. You know, if you're trying to sound cool, it just can your your, your box gets real small. When you, I think you can, but bro, I think you can just rap just to rap. People, you do can, it. you can, but but People when you rap, it. even when you rap just to rap, from a Christian perspective, it's well, let's 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 don't go ten percent. I think we put that. I think we put that pressure on ourselves, bro. Yeah. To like, cause cause this is the thing, like, like even I, even I wrestle with this as a DJ. Right. I'm like, yo, every time I hop on this, I want you to get some type of message out of it, right? Right. right. But really. I'm putting that pressure on myself. Right, right. Like it right. doesn't. Like here's the thing, I could not play. I could. I could go do a show somewhere. Right. I could not play one lick of Christian music, whatever. Right. And then I could after the show, I could go and talk with somebody. They like they just start opening up. Hey man, this is what I'm struggling with, and I pray for them right there. Right. Boom. What's more powerful, that yeah. I played all this Christian music, or that I prayed with my brother and hopefully he 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 felt a deepen. Right, you know something with the Lord right then, like you know, like so. I feel like sometimes we put, we just yeah. I understand which I understand where you're coming from. I think we're in two different little spaces. Well, I'm more talking about like when you're talking about elite rappers. Sure. Um, it's like they have a disadvantage. It's like they playing. It's like they're playing with. Um, it's like they're playing with PEDs. Okay. Like you got Eminem. When you're trying to really string words and you're really trying to get complicated, you can just say anything. You could just go anywhere as long as and you're rhyming because you could just talk about anything. So then a Christian, if he's trying to like keep clean and and, and, and trying fair. to stay relevant That's... and trying to have a message, I think we have a lot more filters. Sure. We have a lot more filters to pass through. Sure. I'm not. I, I'm not really t talking about the other stuff. I'm just talking about just just good Christian MCs. So 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 then that brings us back to GOM. It makes me appreciate what they're doing more mm. because they're considering all that. Yeah. It's like I remember, what, like, like, yeah. say, like, we on it now. Like when Bizzle first came out, he was like catching mad flat because he didn't know the rules. You know, you ain't can't say this, you can't say that, can't say in the n word. You know, you know I never looked at it like that, bro. <laughs> oh, dog. So then he transformed, and that's hey, the thing. Look, I, hey, listen, I was one of the dudes giving him flack. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> And I even even me even me you know I'm like yeah. but then it's yeah. like you, you you know then he comes back on his second yeah. third project mixtape and he's like yo you know and he's just kind of venting out you know what I mean and it's like so so nah but you listen to him now and dog uh, he's like he's clean as a whistle you know what I'm saying with almost everything he's saying you may hear the n word but it's like it yeah. ain't nothing like when he first came out yeah you know and his content is on point and everything I just think to be that good. And still consider the you know those those content barriers. Sure, it's I I just yeah I I elevate them way higher than I like just I, when I hear Eminem, I, all I hear is the garbage. I'm like so, and if 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 I let all my filters off and I just went to garbage craziness, I could just we could be multi syllabicing crazy. You know what I mean? So it's like I I I think that's a high bar of consideration when you hear an MC. So you know all that to say, I really consider that when I'm putting my stuff together. And and my thing is like you know the whole.
whole Christian rapper, rapper this Christian thing. Like I'm, I'm hardcore on the Christian yeah. side. You know me, man. And and it's like so trying to blend trying to blend skill with the real hardcore Christian message. You know, even almost like the cross movement ish type of ministry. You know what I mean? It, it can be complicated, but to make it really sound good and, and, and have these young kids, they kind of frown at you. So it, I, it's it's challenging, I think. To, to blend all the style and all that together. Yeah, I kind of I, I kind of feel that way with like when I when I think about artists like um like Future Migos, um just guys that's kind of in that that like 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 that that really had that new sound out of Atlanta because it's like you you also have some Christian rappers that kind of still have that style, right. but it's like they can't really get away with not with just like mumbling. It's like you still got to kind of say something. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So it's like like one of my one of my favorite dudes right now is Fidel because right. he like he does that style really well, but it's like and, and it's and it's almost deep. Like he he had this one song um uh, not to make this about Fidel, but it's just, it's just on my mind right now. He had this this it's uh it's a new new joint called The Potion. Yep. Right? I think it's super dope, but it's like he doesn't say God. He doesn't say all of that in it. And it's like, so someone asked him, like, "Yo, what is what is the potion?" Right. It's like, "Yo, fam, like the potion is that 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 feeling, that vibe you get when God says, yo, you can do anything. You can, right. you know what I mean?'" So it's, I, I, I feel you. I feel you because there's a certain level of creativity that comes with. I got you. Yeah, that's, yeah. That's, so you know that's that's where I'm at. I, I I like the. So some of your influences. Give me some of your influences. So my influence. Talking about the game. What's my influence, well, I would have to say I'm influenced, I'm influenced by, and I'm serious, I'm serious, I'm influenced by everybody I hear. Sure. You know, literally, and and, and, if, and, and I got a palette of, you know, people in my library, one hit wonders, if you want to say it, like even Christian hip hop one hit wonders, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to take. We got some Christian hip hop one hit wonders out here, Chuck. Yeah, I got some people that they, they, <laughs> they popped up back in the mp3.com era. Okay. You know, okay. I, I got some, I, I, you know, I'm, I'm going to listen to the best secular artist at least once. Sure. I don't need to listen to a whole bunch sure, of times sure, sure, and sure. get that garbage in my head. You know, so I'm gonna get influenced by Eminem. I'm gonna get influenced by the Slaughterhouse. I'm gonna get influenced by uh, 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 a, a lot of people out there. You know what I mean? And then I'm just taking it back to myself. But but real hardcore influences. I mean, you you said it, Rock M, uh, LL Cool J. You know what I mean? Just the the way they rapped. The way they repped, it, it was just the smoothness, the character. You know what I'm saying? I, I mean, I listened to them. I mean, that was back to that. My burn, my I burned my Walkman up with them joints. You know what I mean? And L. Cool J was probably the he was probably the biggest influence. I mean, gosh, every album that he had, I used to know all the lyrics and everything. You know what I mean? So, yeah, yeah. You know what, Chuck? I think I need to throw some beats on, man. Yeah. So we can just, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Let's just, yeah. You, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm gonna just. Let's just let's let's hold up, let's man. See, see, and this is modern technology. It take a little while for this joint to load. Test tech one. We good? Yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Ah, yeah. DJ Wado says this is something you need to something hear. Something you need to hear. Come on, bro. Yeah, yeah. Talking smack, but I butt smack your lack of intelligence. Jack, black, quack, stack of lines. I spit divine lines and rhymes with the intelligent kind of minds. You wouldn't get it, not with it, not down. Forget it, a clown, out of space, out of town. Lights on, not home. Yeah, I got a UPS delivery straight for your dome. Radium power, more powerful than radium 13. Vanadium or titanium, bright sheen. Bring it blue like cobalt, fries with no salt. Rapping for the half life of hydrogen. Christ in my life, he cleaned up my sin. Never mind, you'd rather grind and get grindy. Not a shame, slimy, not my kindy. Kinda stink, like a skunk, full of rancid funk. Returning to the vomit that he's storing up all up inside of his trunk. What a punk! No light, darkness in his sight. Sights on filth, filth, empty plight. With these 
maggot, funkier than a rat, got more wretched than a wretch. That's your bone, you witch. Which of the brothers stole my flow? I don't know, I still forgive him though. Proud of your pus, your drinking piss, and you insist on others to be just like this. If I can open up your mind with the light and the sign, enlighten you to the truth and home in my grind. Fatherhood, brotherhood, love up in my hood. Forgiveness, loveliness, you trust me, we need this. Surround yourself by thugs and surprise you get thug, dummy. You need to rub them out your iPod, shiny. <laughs> ah, forget it. You need them for your crap, and you need them for your crap. You use each other right back, wipe each other like toilet paper. Trade each other's crap that they gave you. Content to stay right at that space, y'all. The way out the vice is Christ. Yeah, act like you knew. But they spit him, beat him till he's blue. Funny he took that ish for you. Got up and brushed it off like brand new. Uh. And went back to running the earth. Decided who to bless and who to curse. You can't play the one that made the playbook. You can't shake the one that made the earth shook. You can't diss the one that made the earth. You can't defeat the one that gave you birth. What's worse is you try to take his attributes. Running around acting like that is cute. Uh. Punk, he'll crush you with a thought, but bought you and taught you how to walk. But you don't care and stare with the glare from over there Like there's a better way from here to there Made the constellations bare Showing his mighty power, arms made bare Andromeda to Beetlejuice, cross the atmosphere Now one hot sun got it sealed to death He sealed the breath, son, it's no contest Undress and drop down in dust and ashes What you need to know, I'm teaching the classes okay. Your thick head, you're caught in molasses But while you're breathing, there's unlimited passes but don't test them. Yeah, you get flushed down with, with the, the masses. masses. With the masses. Yeah. With this the ain't masses. Chuck, man, yeah, my yeah, brother. Man. Yeah, man. Love it, man. Love it. Oh, and by the way, that mixtape, it's in the description right now. You can download it below. Yeah, Saintchuck.com. What's up? Wait a, wait a, radio. Radio. radio.